Yo, what is good, my anime people? What is good, man? This episode of Quitting Heroing was super self-contained. I was expecting us to go into uh, the guy who needs to train the soldiers story, or like go into his issue, but no, 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 no. <laughs> that is. That is not what we are doing this week. Um, learning about this demon series and learning just what the heck our character has already gone through was pretty mind blowing, uh, to say the least, because this definitely makes a lot more sense with the notion of this character wanting you know, certain things, wanting, like, the extermination of the human race or whatever the case is, it's almost as if he was playing the same way uh, that they were towards him, right? Like, that's all they wanted from him was uh, him to be killed off, him to be exterminated, all these different things they were pretty much wishing upon the hero. It still doesn't add up in my book right like why is it that they wanted to do these things to him is it just because he um he was capable of fighting the demons and now he's the only one left so they're scared of him like what in their right mind all of a sudden made them so untrusting of him so uh angry in the fact that yes he is the hero but at the same time he needs to be killed and uh, they wish he, like, never existed type stuff, so it it's a wonderful, wonderful amount of information he gives us, and at the same time, he leaves us out on at the same time, because that's just, that's just how these shows be, they be so clever to be like, yeah, there's something crazy going on for this character, but... We're not going to tell you right now, <laughs> right? We're going to tell you all this stuff that is happening or that has happened, but we're not going to give you outright any more answers than that. And I'm okay with it because, I mean, sooner or later we're going to get these answers, hopefully, um, even if it is in another season. But regardless, this was just another amazing way to introduce... Um, you know, the fact that he has lived for thousands of years, that he has struggled and fought for the humans all that time, practically, until the point where every one of his comrades that were created, just like himself, were destroyed, and he was still trying to be around and help them. <laughs> um, it almost sounds like the 86, where they're kind of over their own kind of people and because of that they want to send them out to places where they have the highest likelihood of dying unfortunately so that's what this felt like just a um, a continuation of attacks on these characters until they practically fell and died um that being said, though, we are in a very interesting point where he's told all this stuff and he himself doesn't know why he is doing it, right? He's questioning them himself. Why am I telling this person all of this stuff? So I like to think that there's still some weird potential character growth for him. Like, he still seems like there's something else on his mind or on his agenda, and if that is the case, you know I'm here for it. I just got destroyed. <laughs> but yeah, I got one more video to talk about, and I got to get to work. So I hope you all have an amazing day, night, evening, whatever the case may be. Hey! I am your boy, the Anime G, and I'll talk to you very soon.